all right this is nifty and daily chart we as we discussed earlier they're still there running uptrend uh, but here in uh, here you can see this area we have seen still running sideway market so in that case we are looking for buy after breaking this raise 10 line but not now uh, we are using some option strategy here to collect the premium and we use uh, I can say credit spread trading strategy so let's see some uh, today gainer stock uh, first here you can see this on SBI life uh, let me check it okay not this one okay oh, symbol okay SBI life SBI and okay I'm not adding I think SBI and um, okay okay let me check it uh, SPI and this one MCX we go to NSC not spot we need FNO SPI let's go to India fix so we need this one also mm. okay MM finance so we leave it SPI mm. SPI and okay here are no SBI and uh, insurance. Uh, so let's see another one. Uh, Kodak Mahinda. Kodak Mahinda. Okay, Legion Kodak Mahinda Bank. Click on there. Okay. Uh, here you can see Kodak Mahinda still running in a sideways. So when prices are running in a sideways, so we are using uh, Iron Condor or you can say. Uh, credit spread but here you can see they are still running somewhere like that so i'm not interested to take buy uh, somewhere there why because right now here you can see it's just up right just below this raise 10 line so this is the raise 10 line right why this one raise 10 so price was rejecting again and again so it is a probability to hit this level and again price may give a correction from this area okay so let's see another one uh, Okay, yeah. Mm, HDFC Bank. Okay, HDFC Bank. Okay, this one bank. Click on there. Yeah, we have seen somewhere there uh, police candlestick pattern even here. So let me show you exactly. Uh, here I can see price clear uptrend. All right, price clear uptrend and all moving average are arranging sequently that's on 20 and this one 200 all right exponential moving average this one 50 uh, 100 and another 150 now you can see all moving average are arranging sequently and what is our logic uh, buy when price are giving a correction so what call buy dip in a uptrend so it's a uptrend clear uptrend creating new higher high higher low higher high higher low and now you can see price right now dip in a uptrend all right so means we are looking for buy now here you can see they are forming a bullish candlestick pattern so i think uh, you people know uh, if uh, if you are familiar in candlestick pattern all right what candlestick pattern are forming somewhere there so this is called one white soldier candlestick pattern all right why because uh, last candle you uh, can see yesterday that was a bearish candle and that today here you can see price open a gap up and close above a previous high point and even here you can see price just close above 20 moving average so when they are forming 
this type of candlestick pattern is a probability to continue toward upside all right so we are looking for buy so let's see in a small time frame like h1 yeah now i can see h1 it should look like different and um, somewhere there we have seen that is a resistance line i can say nearest that one so in uh, we need a breakout so once price break so definitely we'll go for buy remember uh, this is hdfc bank so we need a proper uh, uh, buy signal or you can see uh, they are forming uh, i can say what i can say so let me show you something here that is a re uh, support and that is a resistant and price are running like that like that like that like that and that's somewhere there so that is why we need a breakout all right and even if you want to see there uh, that was a resistance line price was rejecting from this area and we need a breakout all right so that is a perfect buy signal if price break this level and remember yeah, this is the hdfc bank another icici bank so banking sector are bullish now icici bank let's go to icici bank okay icici data okay now here you can see icici also running an uptrend and we have seen um, bullish signal somewhere there even we are looking for buy okay same uh, pattern they are forming and we need the same confirmation and if you not see in a small time frame like h1 they already broke that uh, raised 10 line somewhere there that is the raised 10 line and that definitely we are looking for buy somewhere there okay all right and another stock uh, is dfc uh, first one is dfc bank and now this one is dfc okay same pattern they are forming and uh, you can see creating higher high the higher low but uh, their low momentum according to rsi have you seen rsi are creating lower low but they are creating higher high mm, so means what is the meaning of that so it, they are losing their momentum remember they are losing their momentum it is a probability to goes up little more and it may go uh, reverse back again from this area so as a swing trader, I don't want to hold my position for a long time. Why? Because uh, you can see RSI are diverging. And another one is the FC Life. Okay. Is the FC Life. This one is the FC Life. Now, here I can see is the FC overboard zone and our rule is buy in a buy deep in a uptrend now you can see that was uptrend creating new higher high higher low this point called deep goes up this point called deep and price goes up but price are not in a deep deep fall when price will give a correction but in that case i'm not looking for buy and another stock let me switch the tech mahinda that that will be last one tech mahinda um, tech mahinda yeah this one all right now i can see here um, tech mahinda clear uptrend and price are giving given a correction correction and we need a breakout so in that case we will apply breakout trading strategy uh, we have seen this one a raise 10 line and exactly near raise 10 line so here you can see price hit 
reverse multiple rejection 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 means this is a resistance line so once price break so definitely we will go for buy not now all right so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please like and subscribe and uh, thanks for watching